Hey everyone, this is Madeline with the Marin Child Care Council and HEAL. I am in front of some beautiful kale, which you can see is in the shade. The rest of the garden is actually in the sun. And kale does all right in shadier and cooler environments. And that's because they're in the brassica family. So I'm gonna show you how to harvest kale and then uh, teach a recipe on making kale chips, which is a really easy, fun, and tasty recipe you can share with your children at your ch child care site. So let's go. So here we have some beautiful red Russian kale. And this is a really great technique when it comes to harvesting kale and the way I teach children. So here you have a leaf you're ready to harvest. And what you do is you go to the base of the kale plant and we don't pull the kale because what that can do is pull up the whole plant and that's often what children um, instinctually want to do. But, but what we want to do with this hard stem is actually snap downward. So I'm going to show you. I'm going to snap it and it pushed it downward. Then I'm going to kind of do a little twist and rip it off. So here we go, the full stem, which is edible, as well as the, the leaf. So again, I'm gonna show you how to do that. I'm going to take the leaf I want to harvest. Often they're in the outer section of the kale. And I'm not gonna pull, I'm gonna snap downward and then rip it off. And there you go. Now we don't wanna harvest all the leaves because then the plant won't have enough to photosynthesize. And these sort of things too, you can always come back with scissors and cut closer to the base um, or snap again closer to the base to just kind of clean up that uh, kale plant and make it um, put more energy towards the leaves that it has instead of these stems. Um, so there you go, that is how you harvest kale. So here I have a beautiful bundle of kale. It's quite large, and that's because I'm not only going to be making kale chips, I'm also grabbing some to juice. But um, I'm gonna show you how to make easy, delicious kale chips with your kids. So come on and let's get cooking. Hey everyone, so I am in the kitchen right now and I have my beautiful kale, greens from the garden and I'm going to show you a really simple quick recipe for kale chips. So I preheated the oven to 350 and this is a part that you can do with children. So making sure they all wash their hands and this is a great activity where they get to strip the leaf off the stem. Right there that's a learning lesson. Stem and leaf. Now these stems can be used chopped up, added to stir fries, sautés, um, soups and any other you know kind of recipe you have. So I'm now ripping the leaf into chip size pieces and adding them to my mixing bowl. And go ahead and you can grab some olive oil which goes well with this recipe and slightly lightly coat it with with the olive oil so each chip is lightly coated. This can also be kind of used with hands or you can give it the kids uh, a different stirring implement. Once they're all lightly covered, you can also add some great sea salt to it. I have Himalayan salt right here, just lightly coat it. So I got my cookie tray and I'm going to spread out the kale chips and give them all a little bit of room to toast up. So again, just making sure that they all have a spot. Now these are only gonna be in the oven for five, seven minutes, not very long. And I'm gonna be checking on them to make sure that they get toasted and not too brown. So they're gonna go in the oven for five to 10 minutes max. So here are those tasty kale chips. You can see that they have not turned brown. They're still green, but they are crispy and crunchy. Give them a go. They're delicious. And I don't know what child would not enjoy this as a treat, snack time. So hopefully this encourages you to make kale chips with your children at your childcare site. 
and also look for recipes to incorporate kale into your meal program. Until next time.